let's establish the identity of the cosine of theta plus pi over 2. We're going to show that that's the exact same thing as negative sine of theta. So in establishing the identity, I always pick a side that has a little more complexity to it. So the left side has more stuff on it, so I'm going to choose that one. So understanding that theta is an angle, pi over 2 is an angle, we're going to expand this out using the sum formula for cosine. So cosine, cosine, sine, sine, and then change that plus to a minus. So cosine of the first, cosine of the second, minus, sine of the first, sine of the second, And then fill in whatever you know. So we know cosine of pi over 2, and we know sine of pi over 2. So cosine of pi over 2, 0. And sine of pi over 2 is 1. So the cosine of theta times 0, that just cancels. And we're left with the negative sine of theta, which is what I wanted to show. Let's establish another one. Let's say the sine of pi minus theta. Let's show that that's the exact same thing. It's just simply sine of theta. So again, pick a side that has a little more involved, which is the left side. And I'll expand that out using the difference formula for sine. So sine, cosine, cosine, sine. Keep that sine. Sine, cosine, cosine, sine, change, or keep the minus to a minus, and then fill in whatever we know, sine of pi is 0, cosine of pi is negative 1. So once again, that first term just cancels, so we're left with a positive sine theta, which is exactly what I was trying to show. One more, let's say the cosine of alpha plus beta plus cosine of alpha minus beta. Let's show that's the same thing as 2 cosine alpha sine beta. Okay, once again, the left side has a lot more in it, so I'm going to start there. And then expand it out. So using the sum and difference formulas for cosine, so we're going to have cosine, cosine, sine, sine, changing the signs. Cosine, cosine, sine, sine, change the sign. That's the first one. And I'm going to add on the second one. At this point, we can see that sine alpha sine beta is going to cancel. So I have a plus and a minus, so now we're left with 2 cosine alpha cosine beta. Which is actually what I was trying to show. 